Hi guys, it's Punisher41 here doing another video. A uh, couple updates for you. Uh, well, the, one of the main things is uh, the Sheffield Wednesday transfer situation, I would say you want to call it. Basically, a lot of fans are going, oh, it's which has signed these players, uh, Hull has signed this, should we go after this person? It's the usual rumour mill which you find quite a lot of time on Twitter about oh we apparently this person available we're gonna put a bid in for him or whatever. Uh I think a lot of people are a bit like, yeah we'll get him, we'll get him, let's make sure we get someone before before the good talents like snapped up. I think a lot of them a lot of fans have got to remember uh, something a little bit we still got three weeks till the market closes. Yes, there have been some very good players that have gone to some good clubs. But, like I said, we've still got three weeks left of the transfer window. He'll bring in what we need. Uh, I don't know if he's going to have the money to bring in any tournament because I don't know if he's backing his backing on money or backing his yeah, I'm backing you to keep your job kind of thing. You're not too sure. You, you're never too sure with Dave Jones. I think one of the things I like personally, I like the fact that he doesn't mention any transfer targets. Yeah, it can be really, really annoying for fans, and I get it. I get what, why you're annoyed, and I'm a little bit annoyed by it, but I'd rather not say who our targets are and say somebody else go and get them. I'd rather us just go, right, We've got this target in mind, keep it to ourselves and let's see what happens. Then you then don't build up folk, false hope as well if you don't sign them. Or if you don't sign them or you get outbidded and say there's a fee or something. And I like that policy, I do like that policy. Uh, the other thing is the whole preview game hasn't been uploaded yet. I normally like to upload them on the Wednesday. <laughs> Ironic. Uh, but I haven't done it yet because I recently bought a set of photo lights, which I'm going to probably set up where you can see the camera there. One where that camera is and one at the other side. So, hang on. Brr, camera. About there. Ah, crap. There and there and it will illuminate me better so it will make my videos look a lot better uh, <laughs> don't affect the brilliant editing that I did on the last video as my laptop with my uh, Adobe Premiere Pro ch the charger for the laptop has gone kaput so I'm not, I'm pro I don't know how long I'll be out without that. I'm going to try and see if I can do the same thing on Windows Windows Media oh, Windows Movie Maker or whatever it's called uh, but I prefer, I prefer using Adobe, it's so much better and easier to do but these things happen but like I said I will have up the preview either with the new lights or with that I'll just do it the same way I did it last time with the good old trusty lamp um, yeah, so, Tom, uh, somebody said that we were looking at Leo Lita. I think he would be a good signing. Uh, you forget he's only 28, and he's not really got a look in at, at the Swansea team, so it'd be good to see if he could do something for Wednesday. He knows where the goal is, he knows, he knows the championship, so it would be a good signing. He did go, he did have a loan spell at... Birmingham, but he got a fire injury and he went back. So hopefully that's all cleared up. The other name that's been thrown around is uh, Earnshaw. Get plenty of goals at this thing. Would his... I kind of want to say, would his wages be a problem for us? Kind of thing. And I'm guessing Cardiff probably want to get rid of him. That would have to be a permit. I don't think they want him on the books anymore. But... We'll, we'll have to see. Uh, like I said, I will do a video on any I don't I kinda don't want to do a video on transfer rumours because I'll be on this every bloody day. <laughs> but 
But if I get if we get something that sounds like it's gonna be pretty close to being official, I'll do something. But yeah, let's hope for three points uh, on Saturday. Uh, I'll do that in another video. I've got all the notes written out ready for it anyway. So yeah, guys, hope you're all well and doing well, and I'll speak to you on the preview. Bye.